Hey everybody, Jason here. Uh, it's been a long time since I've done a video, uh, but I've got a number of things planned. <laughs> Who knows how long it'll take to get to those things, but like I said, i got a number of things planned for the site. But uh, real quick, I wanted to do a little uh, mini review, mini unboxing of this vinyl record here. This is uh, a soundtrack, a score for the original Evil Dead movie, um, but not the original score. Uh, Joseph Loduca, who created and, and did the original score for the movie, has come out and wrote new music for the movie and also re-recorded the music. So it's a reimagining, basically, of, the, of his original score with new music uh, put into it along with the original music and things like that. So uh, some of the music that's on it you wouldn't actually hear in the movie. It's kind of like if you were to rescore the movie now, how it would kind of be with a little bit of extra stuff added in. But anyway, this is a super, super uh, limited release by Mondo uh, through their Death Waltz imprint. And I've had this for a couple of weeks now. Um, it sold out within a couple of hours online, so I was really lucky to get a copy of it. Um, and I have opened it up. I have The only thing I've taken out of it was the, the digital download card for the, 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 the score itself. I've seen nothing else on it. I don't know anything else that's in it, anything like that. Um, I just took the, the digital download card out so that wouldn't be on the, the video here. Now, this is on Spotify, and I believe it's also on SoundCloud. But um, So I listened to it on Spotify after I ordered it, and it's really, really good. So anybody who want, likes uh, Joseph Loduca or the original Evil Dead soundtrack, I suggest checking that out. But anyway, let's take a look. So the... Uh, there's a little side card here. It's just got some information about, you know, some upcoming stuff. Things like that. Uh, but this, in the front here, has some good information. I'll, I'll zoom in on this so you guys can read it. I'm not going to read it out loud. So that's the uh, the little side paper that was on the vinyl itself. But uh, the artwork in here is really fantastic. It's got, uh, you know, there's Ash and you know, the recorder and uh, his sister, Cheryl. And then there's the, the pommel of the dagger. And this is a... Uh, a gate, you know, the whole thing is, is a fold over. <clears throat> There's the cabin and the bridge and the delta. And uh, let's see. Here's a track listing. Sorry if the uh, light is sort of in the way there. It's, obviously, it's been a while since I've fooled around with this camera. So that kind of, yeah, it's really, really, really beautiful artwork. I'll flip this back over and get some better pictures of the front. I apologize for the glare and the lighting. It's probably not the best lighting setup for what I'm trying to do, but it's the best lighting I got right now. Oh, wow. Let's get a big shot of that. We'll zoom in. Ooh. 
really all the iconic stuff from the movie. I mean, anybody who's in love with the movie and has seen all this stuff like I have, you'll recognize all that. Nothing on this is new to you guys. This is good stuff. Okay, so after a quick little edit there, uh, I had to set it down and pull the stuff out. It was kind of tight packed in there since I'd never opened it before. But there are the two vinyls. And here's a little uh, liner notes book that looks just like the Necronomicon from the first movie. Really, really cool artwork. Look at that. That's amazing. Hopefully this is, oh, wow, wow, nice and blood spattered there. I hope this focus is good enough for everybody to see it. Here is the Necronomicon. Let's see what the back looks like. Oh yeah. Some artwork from the original book. Here's notes from uh, Joseph Loduca. Some liner notes there. Notes from the producer of the movie, Rob Tappert. And there's some notes from Bruce Campbell. And then there's uh, credits, performer credits and production credits and special thanks and things like that. So that's really it. Uh, I guess there's not really a whole lot more to say because it's such it's just a vinyl record set, but... There is the uh, the collection. I'll uh, do another little quick cut here and show everything in one good solid spot, so everybody can see all the all the artwork and everything put together. There you guys go. There's the whole set with all the artwork, both sides of the vinyl and the liner notes book, and uh, the whole package. So anyway, hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, again, the the track is up on the soundtrack's up on Spotify. And Bandcamp, I believe. SoundCloud, I'm not sure about. I think I said SoundCloud earlier. I think it might be Bandcamp that it's on. I'm not sure. But um, you guys should give it a look. Listen to the original. And then listen to this. And see what the differences are. They're, they're both really good. They're both fantastic soundtracks. So, anyway. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. And uh, hopefully I'll see you guys sooner rather than later with more content. So, anyway. Take care.